Hey guys, it's Cooper here again, and I've got some new pickups to show you. Um, I got a few things in the mail today from eBay. Um, I went to One Goodwill today, and then I had a friend um, who I sell a lot of stuff to. He came over last night, and I sold him some stuff, and I asked him if he had anything with him, and he said yeah, so I took a l I, I looked at the stuff he brought with him, and I decided to buy a couple games from him, so... <clears throat> I'm going to start out with showing you um, what I got from eBay. Um, there's no need to do an unboxing video because it's just really, really, really small items. Uh, the first one is an off-brand uh, GameCube memory card, but it says Wii on it for some reason. Oops. Now, I know you can use it in the Wii, but technically it's a GameCube memory card and it shouldn't say Wii. But yeah, 8 megabytes is I think, <clears throat> I think that's 59 blocks. And I ordered this before I had any GameCube memory cards. And I don't really need this now because I've got like 5 or 6 of them now. Then the other thing I got is Pokemon Emerald. Um, I'm pretty sure this is a bootleg. Um, it doesn't look like the same green. And then if you can see where the sticker ends up here, it doesn't even go to the edge. So, yeah, just be careful when you're buying games like this offline. If they have a bunch of them, they're probably fake. Like, the person I bought this from had, like, five copies of this, five copies of Ruby, five copies of Sapphire. Just like, they had a bunch of copies of all of them. Um, yeah, that's kind of a dead giveaway that they're going to be fake, but, you know, <clears throat> it was only, like, I think it was like five bucks with free shipping for that one, and then this was like, like a dollar fifty with free shipping. So I don't know, it wasn't too bad. <clears throat> uh, the two games I got from my friend last night, um, I sold him a bunch of stuff. He he bought he bought a bunch of his stuff for a hundred and ten. Like I sold him a GameCube, um, a couple Nintendo sixty four games. Um, two, two uh, NESs, just a bunch of stuff, and then <clears throat> so he gave me 110, and then I looked at the games and asked him if he would take 10 for these two. So I got Pokemon Stadium One. The front's really, the front's really clean. Um, he he said he took this one apart and cleaned it, so it's like guaranteed to work. The back has a rip, and it's got some like Sharpie that he tried to get off. But, uh, yeah, I'm not worried about that at all. And, uh, the second game is 007, The World is Not Enough. This one's pretty clean. Um, he's kind of like the, uh, he's one of the guys in Portland that buys and sells a lot. Like, I, I've been to his house, and he just has games everywhere. Yeah, so he buys and sells and stuff all the time, and... His prices are generally the highest um, of any of the resellers. Like, I asked him how much this one was, and I think he said he had it at ten, but he said it hasn't been selling, so he's gonna drop it to eight. And I think this one was at like eight or something. But you know, he's a he's a good friend, so I got him to take ten bucks for the two of them. So I just look at it at six dollars. And four, and I only say six for this one because it's a game I wanted, and I don't really mind paying six for it, even though it's not really worth that much. That's just how I look at it. <clears throat> now we're gonna take a look at a uh, at my uh, e uh, my Goodwill find today. Um, I was going to the bank, and there's a Goodwill right by it, so I just decided to stop. Um, luckily, I found this stuff. <clears throat> Um, the first thing I found is an Xbox game. It's one that I was that I that I have been looking to pick up, and I don't think it's that popular. So every time I ask someone, they don't even know like what game it is, and they never have it. So <clears throat> I got Fusion Frenzy for the Xbox. There's the price tag, <clears throat> four ninety nine. Five bucks isn't bad. It's probably not worth that much. Like it's probably going for cheaper online, but it's complete, <clears throat> and the disc is in really nice condition. And 
if if I was buying this to like resell, I wouldn't pay five for it. But it's a game that I want to keep. I want to play it, so I don't think five is too bad. Um, next, I've got three Nintendo 64 controllers. Um, I haven't taken the price tags off these yet, um, but here's the first one. They're all $4.99. It's got a really nice joystick. The only thing I can see that's wrong with it is this little M on the back. But that's not a big deal at all. So that's the gray one. And then I'm going to do them in order from like, like most common to the coolest one, I guess. So the gray one is the first one. And then I got a solid blue one. $4.99. Good joystick. No Sharpie or anything on this one. <clears throat> and then the coolest one is this one. This is see-through blue. I don't know if you can tell the lighting looks kind of bad, but yeah, $4.99. Really nice joystick. That's as much as it moves. Not much at all. No Sharpie, anything. It's really clean. So I'm happy to have those. <clears throat> and then one last thing I got. Um is is like a GameCube bundle. Um, it's missing it's missing the AV cord so I got the power cord I got two controllers with it black and silver both Nintendo brand really clean it came with a 251 block uh, memory card came with the Game Boy player and then the cube itself it's a silver one the buttons aren't stuck nothing is messed up so yeah there's just no startup disc for the Game Boy player so I've got two Game Boy players now and no startup discs so so if you if you have any out there let me know um, the GameCube was 20 bucks I think and that's with the Game Boy player the memory card and the two controllers which is pretty cool because I'm selling one to a friend um, and I was going to sell him my personal one, um, and I think I might because he said he wanted a good condition one, and I think mine's a little better than this one. But, yeah, so now I don't have to give up my GameCube. But, um, yeah, so that's everything that I got uh, today, and I did get this all today, except for these. I got these both last night at about midnight, so... Yeah, that's everything, and just keep checking back. Um, I know I'm making a lot of videos, but, you know, I just make videos when I get stuff, so just keep checking back. Um, I'm waiting on my complete games to be shipped, so, and I just got another one today, and I'll be buying more tonight, actually, so, yeah, just keep checking back. Thanks for watching, and subscribe.